and welcome to the next dab along which is going to be a rooster. Um, it's the year of the fire rooster this year which means it's going to be a year of creativity, inspiration and uh, the fruition of lots of hard work so I'm really hoping that it's going to be that for you guys. Um, part of the reason I'm doing these stab alongs is not just so that you can learn by rote but I want to encourage your own cre creativity. So if you decide that you want a rooster to be a bit bigger, you want it to be longer legged or have a big head or you know anything you like then I encourage you to try that and I encourage you to do that. Um, the other thing is that I've had a couple of messages about the wire. Now the wire that we're using this time is actually aluminium armature wire and aluminium armature wire is a lot softer than the last wire that we used with the reindeer stab along. Now, the reindeer stab along we used galvanised wire and the reason we used that was because it needed to hang on the wall, it needed to be structured. So it's different materials for different jobs. Again, we're using different core wool this time. We're using uh, an English 56s, I think it is, 56 micron. Um, that holds its structure well. It's easy to needle felt. Um, as some of you know, I'm very, very uh, un impressed with merino. I don't use it. Merino is great for wet felting. Uh, as far as I'm concerned it has very little place in needle felting. Um, same with any other kind of fine wool. There's so many beautiful things you can do with it. It's, it's, um, it's great for finishing off and using as hair and things like that but for actual structural work it's, it's just just a no really for me. I know it works for some of you but you know we, we just don't do that in my groups. Um, so we're going to be using um, different techniques. We're going to be using um, some Norwegian um, wool. Um, I think it's a Norwegian blend um, and we are also going to be using merino but we're going to be using the merino to wet felt and that's going to be interesting. Uh, it's not as hard as some of you think and I'm sure that we're going to get on okay with it. So um, gather your pliers and a tape measure would be a good thing if you can find one and um, we'll get going tomorrow. So I hope you're all alright this evening and I hope you're getting excited about starting tomorrow and um, I'll see you then. Bye. And that's the donkey braying in the background. Nothing to do with me.